Declaring bankruptcy is a legal process that can help repay debts within a reasonable time frame. But it's wise to be aware of all the pros and cons because it's a big decision which could have a major impact on your life. Coming up, I'll explain what bankruptcy is, how it works and what the potential outcomes could be for you. It'll help you make informed decisions about your financial future. Bankruptcy is a form of insolvency where you can either choose to declare it voluntarily or be declared bankrupt by your creditors if they feel that you're unable to repay your debts. In the UK, bankruptcy usually lasts for a year and at the end of that time, most of the remaining debts are cancelled. However, the bankruptcy status will remain on your credit file for six years. The reason many people opt for bankruptcy is for the opportunity to wipe debts and start afresh. It can be beneficial if you're in a lot of debt and can't find a way to pay it back. Although your credit rating will take a long-term hit, the process itself is generally over in a year, but that year could prove to be a very tough one. It's important to understand that while bankruptcy can solve a debt problem, it also comes with some serious disadvantages. Before making any decisions, be sure to consider your own personal circumstances and weigh up the pros and cons. So how much does it cost to declare bankruptcy? The fee to declare bankruptcy in the UK is 680 quid, which can be paid in instalments. However, your application can't be submitted until the full amount's been paid. There are also grants available for those who may need financial assistance. Let's get into the disadvantages. One of the biggest drawbacks is the impact it can have on your credit file. Your credit score will suffer, making it difficult to obtain credit for six years. Details of your bankruptcy status are also made public through the Public Bankruptcy Register. You may also be asked to sell or liquidate your assets, including your home, to pay back your creditors. This could make it difficult to find a place to rent and even affect your employment opportunities, especially in the legal or financial fields or if the job requires handling money. Not all debts can be included in bankruptcy. Student loans, child maintenance, criminal fines and certain court-ordered payments are among the debts that can't be written off. It's important to consider these debts when weighing up the pros and cons of bankruptcy. Your bank account will also be affected. At the start of the process, your account will be frozen, so no money can go in or out of your account. You'll also have to hand over your cards to your official receiver until your essential living expenses are calculated and it's handed back to you. The bank may, however, decide to lose your account. It's important to seek advice from a debt advisor before making any decisions and to consider all the pros and cons carefully. Below this video, I've linked to a form on my new website and it's got a few multiple choice questions like how much debt do you owe and how many people do you owe? At the end of the form, it'll connect you to a company that I've partnered with to provide you with all the information you need. So click the link below, go and check it out and let me know how you get on.